build let's build something with tailwind let's see if this works add tailwind v2 nice okay add the handle style the header with tailwind That's not. He thought I. I don't know, dude. Let's try again. Uh, style. Make it look nice. I guess add some padding. Sometimes uh, codex goes awry and you could restart it. Let's see. Add. Wait. Interesting. I didn't understand that the header is header. Alright, never mind. So change header to welcome to the Bitcoin historical price calc. Cool. Make the font larger and add some padding to the header. Let's say, let's say it's good enough. Add a input a, and a date picker. Input. That's the native browser one. And a button. Check out page. And then let's see what we can do. Um, add a function that receives a date and retrieves the Bitcoin price on Bitcoin historical price from Coindesk, I think, from on that date. Will this work? I have no idea if this API works. No idea. Let's see. Uh, get Bitcoin price. Let's see if get Bit. Oh, uh, this is probably a knife frame, so I should probably sandbox this thing. I think here. Get yeah. Let's see if this works. So date. Uh, does it expect any format? I don't know. Let's see. 2018. Do you want? Do you want? <laughs> okay, so the, the function works. Now let's connect the date picker. So, um, uh, every time I click the button, take the date from date picker and call get Bitcoin price with the Date. Event listener. On click. Date picker value. Get Bitcoin value date. Let's see. So we want to. 20. Nope. 2015. June 9th. <laughs> this is so cool. Oh my god. This would have taken me. I don't know. Like a, like a week to write. No, I'm exaggerating. Um. Yeah, that's awesome.